soundtrack. Hello, everybody. So, welcome to Ridgewood Equestrian Center, I should probably say. Um, my name is Alice Dog Walker. I am the owner of Ridgewood Equestrian Center, and I established it and everything. We have two employees. Um, you can go check out our Instagram, um, which will be linked in the description on our link tree. If you want to go check out the like job applications, boarding applications. So today we're kind of just going to be doing like a tour um, of the yard. So this is the front. So there is a little bit of construction still going on. It's not completely done yet. We're just fixing up some stuff and, um, that happened during building and stuff like that. So first we're going to start off with... Um, well, I guess the outdoor portion of the yard, so. Uh, as you can see, there's some stuff going on. So, when you first come in, you have a nice statue of Secretariat right in front of you. And then as you continue on, we have a horse vet um like horse care center so we have vet f farrier um vet farrier massage therapist chiropractor everything that you need so massage therapist covers chiropractic so yeah all right so the next section over here is just kind of like a holding pen over here um, to just hold the horses that are kind of in the vet area and then these like are just to tie up your horse for like vet checks and stuff so just turn around Alright, so over here we have a nice round pen right up here. So nice and large. Nothing much. Just like a standard round pen, I guess. Up on that slope. Um, then we have, like, kind of a roundabout, just if you have to, like, trot up your horse or something. If it has something, like, an ulcer in its hoof or something, or just something's going on, or just you have to turn your horse around. Doesn't all have to be negative. Um, and then over here we have our outdoor stall options. So in here you have personal attack room and feed rooms. And um, each like s setting has like a um, sink where you can like fill up buckets to wash your horse, etc. They all get like fed every morning they just have hay nets in there and then when you go over here it's the exact same just turn the other way and <coughs> over here we have just like a storage area for hay etc then another roundabout if you're trotting up again, like whatever. So we're just gonna go around the roundabout right now. So you also have some cross country jumps, etc. back behind. 
then we have a podium since we are a show barn. So we need like somewhere to display your ribbons and stuff so you can put your horse on there, put your ribbon, etc. So it's from first to third. Then if we enter these lovely gates, we have a amazing racetrack where you can go around the whole thing, practice racing. Um, eventually, hopefully, we can host races. But for right now, it's just for practice. We also have some steeplechase jumps that you can, like, run around and jump. Um, then in here, we have a, like, grass arena where you can set up some jumps, some cross-country jumps in a dressage arena. Ooh. <laughs> Sorry. Then exiting these lovely gates, we have kind of just a shopping area and somewhere you can get food somewhere you can eat um just so that like you don't starve while you're here duh okay so then if you look into here and you go up these steps there and there's kind of a little clubhouse area um, with a table that has news and pa n newspapers and everything. And just like seating areas and that's it really so. Next area, I guess, is just like a judging area, I guess. So you just, the judges just go up into this little air, this little place, and they can judge you. Um, So yeah, that's the judging like area, I guess. Well, is the judging area. Um, then we have a little fountain with a horse over here. So yeah, very cute, love it. Then over here we just have a little like area, in as the front, which is the front office. So, if you have a problem, you go there. So, yeah. That's it for, like, the outdoor Z, um, barn, like, part of the yard. Outdoor Z, part of the yard, yeah. Well, not really, because there's, like, other things, but whatever. Um, for th in the rest of the yard, but, um, I will now bring you to the rest of the yard, so, which is, like, a couple of steps away, but whatever. Um, I'll just turn off the camera, and then I'll bring you there. So, I guess I'll just show you the rest of the outdoorsy parts of the barn. So, over here, we have boarding pastures, so... These are where all your your horses, if you're boarding here, um, will go if they are on a stall board. So if they are on a pasture board, they will go in the bigger pasture. We already have horses in there right now, but those are just like um, temporary horses that are like almost about to leave right now actually. So or like in a couple of months at least, but whatever. And then we have the lesson barn. It's a little bit dirty right now. It's kind of embarrassing, but yeah, those are also like 
um, horses that aren't in the lesson program. They're just um, board eight, like horses that came here to be like ridden by me and stuff. Um, so, and then we have a round pen over here, so very big. Same as the other round pen, just it's a different color. It's white. And oh, we have the very big pastures. I'll actually go in there and show you. So, yeah, it's very big. This is where your horses will go if you have your horse on pasture board. Um, if you have your horse on pasture board, etc., you will be able to go see your horse, okay? Like, you know, all that. Um, so, then if I bring you over here. Just a couple of minutes like a step away, one minute away, we have our outdoor arena. So very spacious, very big, very amazing. I love my outdoor arena. It's very nice. Um, then we also have a well where you can fill up your buckets and stuff um, and a outdoor wash rack. Then this is where you can park all your trailers. So my trailer is open currently because I had a couple new horses come in. So yeah, um, I have to close that up and everything. Then we have the chicken coop. The chicken coop, like we just like feed them in the morning and then we we'll just let them roam around and stuff. So yeah, that's why we have random roosters and chickens everywhere. So yeah. All right, now I will actually show you the inside of the barn because it's my favorite part. So when you first walk into the barn, this is what you see. You see this door and this these dolls. So as soon as you start actually walking in, There is just a cork board where we put all of our stuff um, from feed charts, etc. Then we have our wash stall and just a random wardrobe thing where you can store your stuff if you would like, like jackets and stuff when you come in. So these are my personal horses that are in right now. Um, None of the lesson horses except for a couple are in right now. So, yeah. These, so Indigo is a lesson horse. So he's going to start being a lesson horse. So yeah, there's a bunch that are mine, but whatever. Um, then if you walk into here, I'll start with this. Um, uh, we have our, just, like, a meeting room and stuff, and, like, it's just a personal employees and border room and, um, Lisa room, so you can, like, go in there to eat and stuff. Um, then over here, we have our tack room. For right now, I just have my... Um, the lesson saddles in there for um, for the lesson horses, but yeah, and lesson like bridles and stuff. Then I have brushes, etc. So in here you, you just can store your tack, etc. Then I have stuff to clean the barn. Um. Then in here I have the feed room, which, um, if it's, if you would like your f to feed your horse by yourself, there is an option on the papers to do so. And so in the little bins, we have 
um, like extra minerals, etc. Um, we are going to have a border come in in a couple of days. So, yeah, you can go check her out. Um, I might link her Instagram. If I do, it'll be, you know, up there. Then more of my personal horses, etc. Um, Woody here will be at one point in the lesson program, though. So, yeah, that's kind of the whole yard that I just showed you. But we're missing a part. Um, also, I forgot to mention we have jumps for the outdoor arena, which... Uh, Outdoor sand arena, which are we have um, poles and jumps and dress as dressage setup. So yeah, all right. I will bring you to the indoor arena now, the indoor jumping arena, and just the normal indoor arena. So yeah, let's go. Okay, so in here we have our indoor jumping arena so in here is where you can f jump your horse so um all these jumps can go higher if you want them to go higher so like these jumps can definitely go higher and these ones that are set up can go up a little bit higher this one can go up one so yeah um it just depends, but yeah, we have extra pulls and all that. So yeah, um, so now in this part of the arena, this is kind of more of a dressage arena. So we use it for more dressage. So we have a dressage setup and some grid work setup and pull setup and what else do we have? We have barrels and pull bending and yeah that's it so i guess that's all for this video um i hope to see you all in the next one good bye